Alrighty, we'll see how this goes. Alright. Not looking too good right now, so on the thing. No drop frame very few drop frames right now. Oh, 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 jeez. Oh. oh. It's working, but is it is it super laggy for everyone? It's working, but it's super laggy. That happens. So go ahead and shut off your just hang up on um, on Skype real quick. And I All will right. go ahead and switch up. We actually got a game, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna beam relay this so you can at least see it somewhat. It's kind of jumpy. I'm gonna go ahead and hang up with the stick right now. It looks like he already hung up. Not. <laughs> All right, so super laggy, but you guys can at least see it. I can't really commentate on any of this. I can see that's a filth. That's a filth. That's a hard hop. That's another filth. Post shot. Lob to the back. Sweet's going for the wall ride. Lash. <laughs> hard. <laughs> it's so hard. Can, all right, try, all right, all right. Try and take it. Go right, ahead and oh, take it. Sweet, go ahead and take the reins. I will go calm. I will go uh, color on this. Just Lash, trade off to me. 56 0. Uh, Hasher from Lash. Post shot from Sweet, hard hop, wall ride from Sweet. Nice post shot. Lash with the lob, wide wall ride. Looks like it's getting slow here a little bit. Lash gonna get juiced. Sweet building it up and he gets it with the hard hop. Yeah, and that was a beautiful pan back panel hard hop there. I, I actually see it kind of clearly now. So, is it better? Yes, it's much better. All right, so I'll go back to the uh, the play-by-play. -play. So both players at juice right now. Lash with that hard hop, though, with Sweets jumping to the left. 19 to 13 in favor of Sweets right now still, but pretty close game here. Both players going with the fill, so now they're, they're curving a little much. And right there with a hard hop goes Lash 27 to 19. So here we go. Lash already up a set, 19 to 27, most likely from the lag, but hey, we'll give it to him nonetheless. Both players on juice, short hop from Sweets, hard hop from Lash, wide hard hop. Sweets drops his juice, hard hop from Lash, post shot from Sweets, and a hard hop to the post from Lash. Goes up 45 to 19 right now, so Lash definitely in the lead here, but does he want to win game one? Both players that we've seen win game one have a lost the games the match is completely sweets with that post shot getting 32 to 45 and here we go wall ride po or hard hop post shot lob from lash once again losing his juice off of a lob hard hop from sweets lob again from lash is trying to keep sweets on that back line so he can play a little bit of defense another wall ride from sweets and sweets up at that midline does ascend the wall ride but lash cheating does get to it and right now hard hop from sweets filth from lash trying to stretch sweets go for another filth and uh, sweets just giving the wall rides right off of those filths from lash and Lash be able to build up a little bit, but that short hop for the corner pocket seals it for Sweets, and he comes back to win that set 64 to 45. Lash should have let it go way before it ever got to that point, but he gives it up, gives the set. We're going to set three, ladies and gentlemen, between Lash and Sweets in the bracket reset. And right now, I mean, with that big point, I mean, what are you seeing from Lash here? Is he making mistakes? Is Sweet just making good plays? I mean, give me your opinion, Stick. Honestly, Lash looked very good in that first set, but yeah, that second set, he just could not get juiced up, and that was what got him, you know, there at the end of the second set. But now we're seeing Lash get up here 19-0, so let's see how this gets ended. Yeah, and both players throwing back-to-back -back post shots. Sweet's barely able to get there. It looked like his character was running super slow, but uh, both players trying to build up their juice right now. Looks like Lash does have juice short 
lob from Sweets. Slides, gets it, goes back, forces the slide out of Lash, and then with a ricocheting shot, the Lash just running around. Sweets gets the score, 23-19. to And it was a beautiful, beautiful play by Sweets there, where he did slide in the middle of the court, picks it up, and immediately threw a fill to the other side to kind of get Lash off of Juice. Lash getting a score there though while wow, I was talking 30 to 23. So both these players definitely very close in the set three. But with that post shot, Sweets takes the lead again. I mean, those post shots really working for him, I would say. Definitely. I think he does get those from being that Stanton man, you know, like I was saying, signature Stanton move is those post shots right to the corner. Yeah, and Sweets almost getting caught greedy there, but manages to get to it. Wall ride from him, and a hard hop. Lash sliding to the wall like it's going to be a wall ride, and Sweets takes it after dropping that first set. Maybe because of lag, we don't know, but he gets that first game to go up one to nothing and you know what i will go ahead and update this for you since you are the one actually doing the uh the video right now i just did by the way i'm oh. on it oh, oh you're on it yeah jump on in yeah <laughs> all right so post shot wide wall ride from sweets a wall ride right back from lash pop up by sweets does not keep his juice sweets trying to build juice up well lash oh as i say that jinx lash loses his juice as well so sweets having to slide on the stretch from lash on that filth corner pocket does not land but that hard hop that very slight hop from lash into the post scores 21 to 6 right now in i mean lash has to win this game i mean the momentum is strongly in sweets favor now though that momentum probably cooled off a little since we did have that long wait due to the bug that's very true and one thing oh gets, Ooh, beautiful greedy there. score yeah greed greed go on but definitely with the the lobs to the back corners and things sweet does what um, other players I don't see do as much as with the back lob. He doesn't go cross court uh, most of the time. It's very rare that he does get that cross court lob. Yeah, yeah, and I mean it's one of those things you see him go with the wall ride most time. He's able to get hashers. He's e even able to get like midline mid courts. So you see him go a lot to the uh, to the wall rides. I mean it's kind of predictable, but when he doesn't get it, Lash is sliding to the wall as we do see Lash with that uh, hard hop pick up set 1 54 to 11. We do see Sweets when he gets those hard hops when he does not get the wall ride. Lash is already sliding cuz he's trying to predict that it's going to be a a wall ride like that shot right there and he ends up missing. So we've seen a couple of those errors on Lash's side, but uh you know they're not they're not mounting up like they were in the first part of this grand finals right but yeah it's just oh got a little oh. bit of greed there again yeah sweets not able to get a handle on that one oh. and right now 20 to nothing I, I'm, we're still waiting on stream to see a jam. Sweets has been in pretty much every match we've streamed after getting knocked down by Lash, but there have been absolutely no jams on stream today. 1720, Sweets picking up that 17 point rally. Definitely. He says no jam today whatsoever. Yeah, and it's always a good feeling when you know you're you're on that back foot, you're about to get jammed. Even if it's like you, you get like the the seven pointer you're like yes no jam another <laughs> wall ride score there for sweets putting us out of 31 to 20 beautiful straight shot from lash and sweets having to slide sweets trying to build back up a lash on juice makes him slide and right now sweets really with his back against the wall Ooh, drop shot May forces the double slide from Lash. Lash unable to keep his juice. Sweets building up now. Two for Lash, one for Sweets, two for Sweets. Lash has to slide, so he's reset. Sweets is on juice. Beautiful, beautiful filth there. Does not land. Wall ride. Sweets not able to keep the juice. The juice. The juice. 
The juice, who's getting it? Lash has it, Sweets has to slide. Here we go, juice, oh. wide hop. And he gets it. Sweets takes the step, thinking it's gonna be a filth, and cannot get back to it. 53 to 31, two sets in a row. So kind of like the first time they met today in the winner's finals. Sweets takes game one in three sets, and Lash comes back and just douses him with fire and juice and juice and juice and more juice and more juice all right so beautiful beautiful uh game there for lash to split it here it's essentially a best of three and at this point i mean i know you're you're rooting for sweets sweets is your boy but i mean from what we've seen game whoever wins game one and loses game two ends up losing the match you think that's going to be the case here in this double dip in this bracket reset i don't know it's happened to both of them so far so if the prophecy stays true then that's what's going to happen but i'm lash is just looking on fire with the juice just slamming down its down sweet's throat with all of the juice yeah definitely and i'm still sticking with my non-prediction prediction of a 3-1 here whether it's sweets or whether it's lash i mean who knows beautiful beautiful corner pocket there gets the block lobster from sweets 27 to 15 because you know they found a rock but it wasn't a rock it was a block lobster exactly oh, oh. all right so both players on juice right now pop up from sweets goes for the skimming filth corner pocket from lash does not get it sweets losing his juice having to build up now but he does stretch lash for that slide so lash kind of on the back foot now juice for sweets can he keep it he does oh. with the hard hop but lash gets it Ooh. wall right sweets what gets it what a rally i agree and right now lash went from that front foot to right on his butt can he get up can he punch sweets back in the mouth here in this first set of game three and you know what he gets bonked it's all he time. didn't punch him in the mouth he punched him in the back <laughs> with the disc get bonked sweets so here we go oh oh Yes, I agree. Beautiful filth. Lash and Sweets going down. If we get to 10 points, it's a pseudo jam point. But no, we're going to get a real jam point. 47 to 48. So next disc wins this first set of game three. You got... Oh, you know. and the misstep from Sweet. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let you handle that one and yelling at Sweets, yelling at your boy. Goodness. It's He's my, so much today, though. He's my boy too, but I'm gonna go with the favorite here of Lash, even though he did just, you know, drop, drop the first game and then the first part of the grand finals. So yeah, here we go, 10 points and get bonked again, Another Sweets. Bonk. Punching him right in that jaw. Does Sweets have the glass know. jaw for the bonk? Uh, let's yeah, let's find out. He does, he does. It's true. That's all you got to do to beat Sweets. You just got to keep bonking him. Double slide from Sweets. Does lose the juice. Lash is at one, but has to slide. So Sweets gets the first build here. Second build. Lash is also at two build. Sweets is going to be a juice. Lash is going to be a juice with that wall ride. Oh, and a short hop. Lash cannot hold on to it. He does have to slide. And Sweets right back to the short hop corner pocket. Gets the score 25 to 18. All right, so we're seeing back-to-back -back wall rides. Another wall ride, Sweets having to slide there. And, I mean, these players keep trading the wall rides. Are they just building each other's juice just on purpose so that they can get to the point where they have juice and maybe can stretch their opponent? I mean, is that kind of the tactic we're seeing here? I don't know if it's on purpose, but it's sure, you know, handy for both of them just to build their juice right there. And then uh, it ended up that Sweet had to throw that lob cost course so he did it and losing his juice no matter what. And filth score, 43 to 25. Sweet's in danger of dropping a two-setter here. Slide from Lash. Slide from Sweet's, but he does get to the lob. Beautiful hard hop. Oh, and Lash able to get there on the post shot. Corner pocket does miss. Hard hop from Lash into the wall ride from Sweet's, and Sweet's has evened this up, 44 to 43. So I can almost tell you this is going to go into a pseudo, ladies and gentlemen. I can hear myself. <laughs> oh, I sound sexy. And there it is, the straight shot. Sweets caught stepping. And it's 54 to 44. So right now, 
Sweets in trouble. Is this going to go the way that the last two matches have gone? Is it going to be a 3-1? Is Lash going to take a fourth tournament in a row? Your thoughts, Stick? I don't know if it's just because it's getting late or what, but Sweet just multiple times has been, you know, having those misplays of the uh, block lobsters getting bonked and even the getting greedy and things like that. So, I mean, Sweet needs to pick up his game a little bit because Lash is looking on fire, especially with that last set. Yeah, and definitely when you look at the points right now, Lash is a whole game worth of points ahead of Sweet right now. It was 349 to 347. Or, sorry, 349 to 247. So here we go, getting started on game four. Sweets has to win this game, or once again, Lash beats him. Beautiful wide wall ride there, 14 to nothing for Lash. Sweets down in a hole early here in game four, a game that he needs to win. Yeah, those those uh, wide wall rides are getting sweet a little bit. Yeah, and I mean, for me, I can't even hear them, so I I don't even know their wall rides until I see them actually, you know, curve back and become wall rides right now. That's so true. it's beautiful filth from sweets, and then filth from lash makes sweet slide lash on juice. Sweets trying to build, cannot, has to slide, post shot, pop up from Lash, does not keep the juice, error there from Lash, having to slide there on Sweets' post shot, another corner pocket from Sweets, slide from Sweets, Lash almost getting the super walled ride, wide wall ride, and here we go, hop from Lash, lob from Sweets, and a nice curve from Lash there, and it looks almost like they're quick curves, and you know, nice short hop from Lash there, Right now, Sweets pushing the net. Does manage to get in front of that front line for the short hop and get the score. Evens it up 31 to 30. So right now, you know, Sweets doing a changeup. We saw both these players changing up in the last part of the in the first part of this grand finals. And Sweets starting to, you know, bring out something a little new with playing a little more aggressive. Is that going to kind of turn the table for him at this point, being down 2-1? Definitely, I think so. You know, it's just like I've been saying the whole night on that mindset, he does take that set right there. Yeah, that corner pocket shot lands. That was a huge pickup there from Sweets. And just sending it right back on that filth on Lash. I mean, is Lash feeling the pressure now? Like, it, he, he has to be at this point. You know, he knows that, that Sweet is starting to get fired up and starting to get that momentum built. And once that happens, then ooh, it's all downhill. Oh. Oh, oh, that was dirty. Yeah, it, if anybody you don't want to give any momentum to, especially when they're down, it's Sweets. We've seen it time and time again. He has pulled out some amazing comeback upsets. And right there with that wide hop, Lash gets the score 13 to 18 here. So, I mean, Sweets, if he can win this set right here, he sets it back to another split, and he goes with the momentum of having won two sets to none. But Lash at least needs to get this set here. Beautiful hard hop from Sweets, lands the points, 33-13. A whole hell point worth of points ahead is Sweets at this point. And, I mean, is it is it paramount that Lash at least wins this set here, even if he loses the game? Or does going down two sets to none really not not matter here as Sweets goes to advantage? I think it's going to affect Sweet a lot, especially with his momentum. And, you know, like we were saying, you don't want to give Sweet this momentum. And um, he does miss it right there with the greed, so he's not going to get it. Um, Greedy. Yeah. All right, so Lash right now does miss on that lob with getting a perfect. Both players trying to build up right now. Sweets has to slide, so Lash also missing is perfect. And once again, Sweets pushing up, becoming the more aggressive player, getting to the net, throwing that hard hop, throwing Lash off, and we're going to game five once again. Sweets splitting it again, evening it up. <sighs> I mean, Lash still 40 points ahead, 41 to be technical. He's almost a full set ahead, but Sweets switching it up. And that, I mean, that switch up was probably the most important part of that game, right? Just becoming the more aggressive player. It was definitely. And, you know, like we're saying, it's going to bring him so much momentum now that Lash is going to be on his back foot and he needs to, you know, play technical and be sure to not give anything to Sweet whatsoever if he wants to win this in this game five.
Yeah, definitely. So this is coming down to the very end wire. We've had a lot of delays because of Sweet's bug. <laughs> but we are here, ladies and gentlemen. This is the last game of the tournament of this North America solo jam. And right now, both players trading, both players at juice. Lash having to slide, so Sweet's pulling out that filth, hits that second to last panel, gets the first score of the game, and that's gonna be a big one for him, especially with the fact that he had the momentum. You know, he can let that one go there with the 12-7, but that first score of the game, so important for Sweet's to come out and get, uh, especially to increase his momentum. Definitely, for sure. Talking from experience, you know, if you do lose that first rally, even if it is just a, you know, a 12-point rally, it does feel like so much, and you feel like that you need to catch up. Yeah, I mean, at that point, you start thinking, jam. Am I exactly. going to get jammed? Especially if it's like, you know, a, a point that's close to hell point. You're really thinking, oh, no, I don't want to get jammed, and you start making mistakes of your own. And right now, Lash kind of in that mindset i think as we're up 35 to 7 for sweets beautiful filth from sweets playing on the back line lash trying to play a little more aggressively you know pick up what sweets was doing last game does have to slide sweets getting that wall ride juice still on juice the hard hop sweets getting so greedy <laughs> The sound effects makes it all so much better. Yeah, all right. So 35 to 24, Lash getting a big score right there. Not quite a hell point, but he does pick up enough points to put him just down by 11. And right now we're on a 15 pointer in that ricochet shot. Oh Lash goodness, has to. Right I, Lash basically got run over that that last game and that last set. He needs to figure something out here. He is on juice. Sweets is on juice. I mean, what is what's Lash got to do here? That would that to start with that is a good one. But what else exactly. does he have to do? He needs to start bringing out those technical curves that he had. You know, those saw blade fills were just perfect, and especially you know at the right timing. So right now his fills are getting a little too curvy, and goes right back to the middle, right to sweet. Yeah, and post shot there from Lash almost gets Sweets to slide. Sweets, so greedy. <laughs> All right, so 29 to zero, Lash and Sweets battling it out here in game five, set two. Can Lash send this to, you know, the final set in the final game? Does have to slide, loses his juice. Lash oh. giving up the point on the post shot to Sweets. And you know, it was probably a good thing because Sweets was at juice, Lash was at nothing. You know, don't give up the big yeah. points. Don't give up the big points. Let him. Oh, a tech slide out of Sweets. They're still possible, ladies and gentlemen. The tech slide dream is still possible. Back to back wall rides from each player. Nice filth from Sweets there. Does not continue his streak, however. Another blue out of Sweets does have to slide. Lash still on juice. And that oh, wow. middle filth from the wall to I the don't middle. I don't know if you could hear that or not, but that. No. Right there was actually a wall ride. That shot. To get that, that shot side. was a wall ride, ladies and gentlemen. It was a wall ride. Oh. My oh. But you know what we're at? We're at the last set of the last game of the last part of the of the tournament the grand finals double dip sweets getting the first score in this game so in this in this game right here in this whoever scored first in the set has won that set so right now if you're a superstitious person you're you're banking on sweets right now but don't count lash out he's won the last three it's very true all right, so both players using block ups. Nice wall right there. Sweets able to block it up and grow so greedy from Lash. Which is a beautiful shot by Sweet. It, it really was. And Lash actually getting caught in that hop zone with that greed. Oh, I almost thought that was going to be a super. Yeah. Sweets it's having to slide. I think Sweets nice. thought it was going to be a super too and was bumming about it. Because we have not seen a super between these two all day. Beautiful filth that causes the slide. And Sweet's going right Ooh, back to the filth, scoring fill. the exact hell Four point. Away. And he is at advantage, ladies and gentlemen. As long as he doesn't get so greedy, he will win this. But dude, Lash coming back. Lash is not yet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Now the saw blade filth. We saw Lash 
destroy Swedes with the saw blade fills when they met in the winner's finals. And how does this end? This grand final double dip on game five in set three ends by Sweets finally taking a win back off of Lash with the shot that put him into the loser's bracket. So congratulations to Sweet making it over the hump, beating his rival finally in a tournament. It's been a long time coming. Sweets is back on top, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think Lash can take that number one spot on the power rankings. Yeah. That's very true. You know, everything that we were talking about before, like like you said, we were writing G Suites eulogy almost, and he just said, screw everyone, and decided to come back and win it in this bracket reset three to two. Yeah. Just the closest yeah, pretty, closest pretty much. Matches. So I'm going to give you that call back, that video 